Hello everybody, my name is Markiplier and welcome back to Subnautica. Now we gotta get moving here because we got a lot of stuff that we're gonna be doing today. I'm gonna build an alien containment chamber to finally house these eggs that I've been finding. And I'm gonna do it in my secondary base. Not the base I'm about to build down the deep depths of hell. I still have to get more materials for that. But before I go on gathering materials again, I am going to do something that's actually useful with my time. And I'm gonna have some friends. Like, who'd have thought that? Markiplier with friends? What is this? I thought we were playing Subnautica here. But no, alas, it is true. I am about to have some real, honest-to-goodness fish friends that I promised I won't eat. So I'm gonna put the lockers up here, and I'm gonna read the names off the lockers, but before I do that, I need to actually do that. So, here we freaking go. Okay, so the first one goes to Alex Sifon, and people have been wondering how to get names on the locker. It's really just, I pull from the comments down below. So if you want your name to accompany me down into the depths of hell, write a comment! Give me some advice, make me laugh, do whatever you want, put a comment down there, so thanks guys. But Alex says, The jokey Kassar pod is buried beneath the sand. The pod entrance was literally just below you, and you didn't realize it. Sorry that you didn't know this before, but now you do, so thanks so much for that advice! I might go back there, but I'll go back there with Bubble Butt if I do to save some time. Next up is Samantha Schnettler. Who said there's something fishy about everything going on, but hey, what are you gonna do about it? I'm sure you can manage. We cod all do better, don't you think? Well, I best be off. If you see a friend, don't forget to wave, and also if you think of a better fish pun, let me know. So I'm officially gonna be banning Samantha Schnettler from my YouTube comment section because those are beyond Wade level of puns. And the next one goes to Astro Hard Ammo, who I'm putting here as Astro Hard. Could you not cure the Karar virus with Peepus? And everyone knows that cold, delicious Peepus solves all life problem. Shafatul Islam said, Mark, the sea dragon leviathan egg is found in the disease research facility, and then you can put it in the alien containment chamber. After a few days, it will hatch with a baby former of himself. Then you can mess around with it, but be careful, it could die. When the creature is hatched, it will not attack you. Imagine to have your own pet sea dragon leviathan that is not deadly. Can't wait for it. And you will have to wait for it because I believe that's in the dev build and right now I'm playing the normal game. I may go to the dev build again and in fact I probably want to do that. I was just fear- Ah, oh, fuck, there's rocks! Ah, oh, shit! I can't drive here! I'm actually gonna- Oh, apparently I'm actually gonna do a flyby of Jokey Kassar again, so maybe, just maybe, I can find that sea pod where that is. But then again, maybe that's in the dev build of the game, and, and maybe I do want to go over to the dev build. You know what? I'm gonna do it. I've gone back and forth before. I can do this again. Why not? Hey, YOLO or something, am I right? Mmm. 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 Whoa. Whoa. What? What? You have chosen not. To activate chemical taste neutralization. What? Thank like you and have a nice day. Oh no! Oh, 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 oh! What? Damage? You didn't say anything about getting damaged! Oh, I was slamming my hole all over the place! How am I gonna be able to kill the dragon? Okay, but wow, this. Oh! Oh, there have been some updates! Oh! Oh my god, this is beautiful actually. Holy shit! They've updated just about goddamn everything! Holy shit! Oh my god! This is amazing! Okay, I gotta eat or something because that's about to kill me, but... Holy shit! Ah, oh, so pretty now! Oh, I like the unification. Whoa, was what did I just click? What? Why the decoy loading tube? What do you mean the decoy loading tube? What is that? I don't know what that is. Can you explain it to me? Uh, I'm so confused. Alrighty then, I'm just gonna put these in my mouth because I believe that still works like I think it would. Okay, so that worked. I got food inside of me, and the new user interface is just pretty damn cool. Okay, but at least everybody's still here. Astro Hard, hold on to this shit because I'm gonna need to uh, go on an adventure here. So I'm just gonna. Yeah, I'm gonna put these back in Jonas Grav, which is where that should be, but 
Everything seems to be good, so I'm gonna go out and I'm gonna see if I can repair something. That is- that is- that's bizarre. There's actually an animation for that now. Boy, howdy, they're putting some polish on this bad boy. Oh my god. Maybe that's what the banging was before. Let me put this over here. Oh, click and drag interface. I love it. Shoop! Oh, sweet digs, bro. I think I got the ion battery in this bad boy. Oh, damage. Let me repair you. Never mind, apparently. Ah! Blap. Okay. So now I actually have to be careful with this son of a bitch. I know, foreign concept for everybody out there, but, uh, you know, I'm gonna just try. Just try a little bit. Not try very hard, obviously. I don't want to actually put any effort into what I do in this. But I'm gonna try, just a little bit. Oh, look. An O2 indicator that I'm going to ignore and then drown all the time. All systems online. Oh, boy. Calculating. Cap- Cap- What- What did you just say? Cavitating? Excessive noise? Did you just purge the ghosts? Holy shit, he just ghost busted this bitch. Oh my god, the whole thing listed to the side and then we... I no more ghosts. Oh shit, alright then. So all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this out of there and I'm gonna charge it up. Because apparently we're taking a bit of power here. Ooh. Let's see. So you're normal power cells, but I thought I had... Moria. Uh, you know what? That's okay, I'm gonna just... I'm gonna trade out, because I can. Oh, it looks so pretty! It do! It looks so pretty! Like, no joke, it looks real pretty. The only thing I don't have is a full readout of how much power my... My thing has. It's not at the top anymore, unless that green bar is it, or unless it's some sort of objective waypoint thing. But either way, we got oodles of power, so I'm not exactly worried about that, but... Alas, we go, and apparently that's a sonar navigating system which any self-respecting submarine would have! But that does not change our objectives, except it changes exactly our objectives. So I'm gonna go over to the Mongolian Emissary and- Oh... Well, there's my power meter. Apparently. Oh. A hit flanked emergency counting. We can go faster! Rig for silent running. Oh my god. That is so cool. If we go silent running, does that mean we're not gonna disturb any of the the people out there? Oh! Torpedoes or is that the decoy? Oh, I love it! I love this! Okay, here we go. We're gonna cavitate and cause some noise, but we are booking it, baby! I don't know if we're going any faster than we have in the past, but we are fucking booking it! Fact, emergency speed. Emergency speed? Yeah, you're goddamn right, emergency speed, but we got an ass load of power in our back, so we don't even need to worry about that. So that must be the noise, so what if I... Honk. 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 Oh shit, that's so cool. That's so cool. What is that? Oh. Oh. Morning. Cavitating. I don't know what cavitating means, but I'm assuming that's bad. And also, that radar screen is awesome. It reminds me of the game Homeworld. Do you remember the map view of Homeworld and Homeworld 2? How it would just zoom out and you'd see like the, the 3D representation of the map and navigation points that it would have therein? Ooh, hey. Good to know that you're still doing backflips. And apparently it seems to be loading a bit smoother than it has in the past. Oh man, I wonder what new secrets are available in the dev build. Oh, the experimental version is so cool! Why did I ever leave? Why did I go back to release? Why did I- Oh, that's right, because my save broke and, and like I literally couldn't open my save anymore, but now I'm back. Oh, I am back, baby, and you are just freaking weird. Oh, hi, big mushroom tree mama. Getting a few low frames here, but at least you're looking good, and that's what matters. Oh, I'm gonna hit these, aren't I? Yeet! 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 Ah, shit! Oh no, did I- did I do dabblage? Did I do some dabblage? Probably. Oh, wait, what? Did we miss Jokey? Oh! Apparently we missed Jokey Kassar. Let's circle back. Oh, I see it now. I think I see it. Oh. What the fuck? What the fuck is attacking me? What the fuck was that? What? What the fuck was that? Oh, something's hanging around our ass end and it does not like me. 
Uh oh, it's coming! Okay. Ah! Shit! What is attacking me? What the fuck? Warning. Creature attack. Well, geez, that's no good. We're not doing a lot of damage, though, so I'm assuming it's not like a, a leviathan or anything like that. Is it? God damn it, stop hitting me. I'm gonna slap you. Who's slapping me? Huh? Oh, it's just you, you little shark bastard. Oh, why don't you take it up with... Well, not me, because I don't want to fight you, but why don't you take it on someone your own size? Big Box Barry is a gentle giant. Just being a bully. Leave him alone. He's a father. Oh, hi. Hello, life pod of Jokey Kassar. How are you doing? What is this? What is that? Open data box? Whoa. What? I don't know what that is. What is that? What is that? Jokey? How you doing, Bubbo? Okay. I got a voice log. What is that? What is that? What is that? Oh, that's the new lithium? Well, how am I gonna be able to know what anything is anymore? Oh, everything is Garbo now. Oh, no, everything's changed. Oh, absolutely everything has changed. Oh, my God. Oh, I'm gonna need a few. I mean, I need a few minutes to wrap my head around all this bullshit. But here we go. Let's listen to the voice log. Oh, Hey, what the fuck was that? What the fuck was that? You're just gonna be dicking with me this whole time, huh? Jeez. Alright, anyway. Whatever. Wait. Uh. Data downloads life pod. Here we go. Life pod systems online. Passenger 07, Emissary Jokey Kassar has boarded the life pod. Life pod launch sequence initiated. Life pod detached to the Aurora OK. Onboard microphone recordings. My creators, the cherishers and sustainers of worlds, give me this day my daily goods and allow me my pleasures as I allow those who seek pleasures from me. Well, that's creepy and weird. Entering planetary atmosphere, external temperature, approaching critical levels. Show me the path in life, in truth, and love, in substance, principle, and mind. For mine is the power, I am the one forever and ever, on and off and on again. Exterior hull damage, life force systems failed, impact intimate. Life is a game which the universe plays with itself. I am done pretending to merely be merely this bundle of flesh. I am ready to play for a different side. Well, he was doing his death prayer, I think. Pretty sure that's what that was. Huh. Weird. So what was the thing that I got from him? Cause I got something. But what did it mean? Like, it, it said something about... It modified my crafting systems or something like that? God, I, I really don't know. Oh, that's super weird. I'm gonna have to- You guys are gonna have to tell me about that one because I don't know what that- well, Okay, I just pissed myself, but I don't know what that was. So I gotta find that out later, but I will get to that in a little bit. Oh, everything looks so shiny and new. Oh, I'm gonna drink this payoffs. Okay then. And then I'm gonna take some more fruit and then I'm gonna be good to go. That is gonna take forever to fill that battery, but... Alas, we have plenty of power with which to do that. Okay. And away we go! We need to rendezvous with Bubblebutt and then make ourselves everything that we need. And apparently we're cavitating and making too much noise, which is going to cause us to become attacked. Cavitating. Is that something like attractivating or, or bringing towards us? Because apparently nothing, nothing likes noise, which means that suddenly we're in danger again. Which is both a good and bad thing, because in any game that has horror elements, and this is definitely one of them, you can't say it's not, but in any game where you remove the threat, and you give yourself a safe harbor, like this boat that was invincible, it becomes less threatening and therefore less scary. But now, I'm in danger wherever I go! No matter what is out there, it might be able to kill me. And I know that this can now go a little bit faster, but I don't think that's enough to be able to get away from, say, a Reaper Leviathan, or a Sea Dragon, or anything of that sort, which means that when we approach such monstrosities, we're gonna have to creep. 
as quietly as we can. And try to avoid all the monsters of the deep. And I guarantee you, in the uh, experimental build, there's going to be monsters of epic proportions that we cannot even come close to imagining. Excuse me, Honky Honk! Are you the monsters of epic proportions of with which we cannot possibly imagine? All right, fine then. Have a lovely day. Don't look at me like that, you weird, weird monster. I will not pay child support. Get out of here with that bull. All right, I'll meet you back at the base. Uh, oh, I see bubble butt. Oh, hey, 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 whoa, whoa, rocks. Jesus, no one warned me about that. I didn't get it. Oh, there it is. There's the proximity warning, Jesus. All right, going back to cavitating. I'm aware we're cavitating. I don't know why you gotta say that in such a threatening rumble. Oh, me old base. What a lovely place. Oh, ooh. hey, Warpy Woo. Hopefully, you're not gonna be a dick to me. Okay. So I got my moon pool here. Yeah, how about you stop being such a douche? Have I got the outside floodlights? Did they fix this and make it any better? Maybe. Through the cameras, definitely. Well, did they make the. Okay, bye then. Did they make the warper bigger? The warper looked a little bit bigger to me. Okay, so I gotta go trade these on the, uh, the Seamoth and replace the, uh, replace, uh, Mr. Fister in there because I'm gonna be taking the Seamoth well, out and about because the Seamoth is so flippin' fast and I kinda wanna see if there's been any updates to the Seamoth. Hello? Oh, that's not good. Oh, that's not good. Oh, that's not good. Oh, that- oh, that's not good. I forgot that I didn't have a hull modification in that, so what I gotta do is I gotta build one of those before I do anything else. Alright. What do we need? Plasteel and computer chip. I can do both of those things, because I got all the necessary materials. I need to make an ingot. Uh, ba 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 Do we have power? We do have power here. Man, those bio- are, are we serious here? Those bioreactors have been make, making- What have they been making power out of? Cuz it's been ages since I filled you. Oh my god. I don't believe that for a moment. I'm sorry, I just don't believe that. I, do, I just do not believe that you have power here. Because that is a goddamn ridiculous- You? There's no way that you had power! This is a load of bullshit! Okay, but either way, I got my plasteel ingot, and thankfully I don't need to go any deeper than just this. So I've got... whatchamacallit. I'm making a plasteel ingot. So we got a plasteel ingot, and then we need a computer chip. I believe all my silver is back in my, uh... My Cyclops, so I'm gonna go for that. Sploosh! Okay. Sloop. Alrighty then. Sloop de woop de. All systems online. All systems are in line. Thank you. Again, why does it every time I get in this thing, it, it pushed me back? Why? There's some wonky physics going on here, but then again, it is experimental mode, so I guess that's to be expected. Alright, so I need, um, I need to make a computer chip. You got it, buddy boo. I know where to do that. I've got silver in here, and then I've got coral. Coral! Where's the goddamn coral? Coral! No. Coral? Table coral? Yeah, table coral. That's it. And god, all these new icons, I have no idea what they are, but at least they're more distinct. Like, that is something that I can't applaud about it. It is definitely distinct now. Alright, so I need to make a computer chip. Oh, what? Gold? Gold? Did they change that? They changed that, didn't they? Gold? Well, good. Maybe that's gonna be less silver required because silver was overused and gold was not used. You're telling me that shit ain't gold. Fuck you. Gold, gold, gold. There it is. And then what else? What else did you need? Copper wire. So we need copper. Okay. Copper, 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 copper wire. Which makes sense. I don't even think it needed copper wire before, but it didn't seem to do that for the computer chips. But now... Computer chip kind of makes a little bit more sense here, because usually for electronics, when you're connecting things, it's usually gold that's going to be used for that. So when they didn't have gold available, then I was a little bit confused. Did we list again? Every time I go up those ladders, like that particular ladder there, every time I go up it, I am 
I'm a mile away from my base. In the open ocean, it's goddamn terrifying out here. Don't do that to me. That son of a biscuit. All right, here we go. Bubble bumble butt. All right, so we're gonna make this the pressure compensator. Because we need to- Oh my god. Jesus. Flashing lights, no joke. All right, put you in this bad boy here. And boink, crush depth is now 300 meters. Barely what I need, but it's enough to get by. So I'm gonna just, I guess I'm gonna take that for what it is. Okay, hi. Why did you do that, Mr. Warper? Ooh, missed me by a hair. Missed me by the hair on my chinny chin. You're too fast for me! Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I don't like that at all. So you can go F yourself, Mr. Warper, who is now much more aggressive about his job. Which I would expect the Warper is there to contain. What, what did I do? What hurt me? What did that? What are you talking about? Oh, I'm gonna ram you. If you're gonna be a son of a bitch, I'm gonna ram the shit out of you. Get wrecked! Bam! Oh, fuck you, dude. I bet that killed you. I bet it did. I did some- I did a number on my- my guy here, but... He's doing okay. He's doing alright. So I'm gonna go out and I'm gonna repair that real quick and then I'm gonna move on because it seems like things are... Uh, giving me some agita. Alright, so if I can fix the goddamn leaks, which- oh, no. Oh, man. This makes it a lot more stressful! This makes it a lot more problematic! Oh, fuck. Ah, oh, Jesus. Okay. We got that. Ah, oh, jeez. Goddamn, what are they doing to my boat? Bumblebutt. Big Box Barry. They're doing everything to you guys. Okay, I gotta get in and I gotta get my... I gotta get Mr. Fister into the upgrade chamber because I need to upgrade... that. No, I fucking gotta go get eggs. I haven't even done that. I haven't even made my- God, stop that! Stop that! Oh, fine. I just need to stop going up that elevator now. Okay, here we go. Sploosh. Oh, use the jets. Okay. Fire. Okay, we're almost there. Whoa, what? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Holy shit. Oh, this is hard to control, huh? There we go. Okay. Nailed it in there just by the hair on our chinny chin chin. Why is this underwater now? What the fuck did you do? What? What happened? What happened to my base? What did you assholes do? What did you do? What'd you do to my base? Ah, oh, fricky dick. Seems like it's out of power suddenly. Oh, jeez. Okay, so I need the prawn suit jet upgrade, which means I need kyanite, sulfur, and plasteel, which I think I can do, and I think I have, if I remember how to make kyanite, which I believe is that material... I believe it's not something to be made, I believe it's just that material that's in, uh, one of my storage units, because I have sulfur and I have the materials to be able to make plasteel, but man, this is getting... It is getting rid goddamn ridiculous. Oh wait, that's it. That that stuff? Kyanite, it is! Okay, so I have the kyanite. I have exactly three, which is... Whew, thankful. Oh, there was more in here. Okay, good. Okay, but I'm gonna leave it in there for now, and then I'm gonna make another plasteel and get one... Doop, okay. And then I need lithium right... Right! Uh, right! Right, right there, okay. Man, this is... this is weird. But I like it. I like new. I like new. I gotta, I gotta admit, I like change. I do like change. Some people don't like change. Me? Me, I like change a lot. A lot, a lot, a lot. Okay, so we got the plasteel, then we just need to make these. No, we just need to take the sulfur over there and we're good to go. We're good to go! Then we're gonna get a jet upgrade on this bad boy and that's gonna be the first step onto the new me. The whole new world that is me. For some reason, this is still underwater, and I don't know- It's even higher underwater! What happened here? What is happening? Why are you drowning? Why are you drowning? This makes no sense! What is happening to you? I don't understand! But I got this, I- I guess! Something is happening here. Why? 
It's just getting further and further underwater. This isn't right. Something's going on here. I don't even know. I don't even know, man. What? Uh, the only thing. Ooh, whoa! I thought that was my shadow. I thought it was a creature. The only thing I know that I. What is that? Oh my god! When did this happen? When did this happen? When the fuck did that happen? Are they out of their gourd? Are they out of their goddamn mind? Draining systems initiated. Oh, I didn't even know there was gonna be damage! I didn't even understand that! When did that happen? Well, are the draining systems active or are they not? Because this seems to be not drained. Jesus. Jiminy Christmas, a good good thing that all of my uh all of my devices are waterproof. Shit, oh, there we go. Sploosh. Give me some oxygen here. Oh, man. That was so weird. It must have been when my big box berry, like, splooshed all over the place. Oh, man. I need a coffee because this is ridiculous. What? I can scan this? I have it. Why do I need to scan it? Alright, here we go. I need to scan you before I use you. Yeah, I'm gonna use you and scan you at the same time. There we go. Coffee Americano. Bloop. Okay, well, I got that. So that's good. Okay, so I think I'm gonna have to end this episode here. I did not get everything that I wanted to get because all of this new stuff just punched me right in the face. But I'm gonna roll with the punches and I'm gonna keep going with this, so thank you everybody so much for watching. Everything that's in these new experimental builds Bear with me and help me out right in the comments of what I'm supposed to do and where I'm supposed to go because these new things are going to be rolling at us every day now. And uh, we'll see what happens. So thank you everybody so much for watching. And as always, I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye!